Hi, my name's Kiara, and I'm going to be helping you with the first violin part of Impulse. The first thing you're going to do is look at what key signature we're in. From this one, you have two sharps, the first being F sharp and the second being C sharp. This means that we are in D major. A good thing to do is also listen to the recording. The recording of the piece will help give you a feel of how the piece should sound, along with getting you just like getting that inside your head. While you're doing this, it is a good idea to pizzicato the piece along with it. You don't have to get it perfect because by no means is it going to be perfect. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to set our metronome to 70 beats per minute to get this piece started a little bit slower so that we can get it more efficient and just pretty smoothly. Now, that was at the slower tempo. Um, something you're going to see in here at the very end is a part where it says divisi, or D-I-V, above the notes. That means that the inside stand is going to play the lower note, and the outside stand is going to play the higher note. Not all of the things in this piece is going to go as smoothly as you want. Some of it is going to be challenging. For that, you're going to want to take the tempo a little bit slower and practice those pieces isolated so that you're able to get those down and then work your way up to 
the tempo you're currently playing the rest of the piece at. That will ensure that you get that, pe that piece of the music down and you're moving forward. Once you're able to play this entire piece at 70, start moving it up 5 beats or 10 beats. It just moves at a slower pace and it may be a little uncomfortable, but you'll be able to move into concert tempo at a slower pace than just, oh, I did it at 70 and then now I have to go do it at 140. Like, that's terrifying. Um, so, yeah. Take it up five clicks per, like, five clicks per minute or, like, ten clicks. It just makes it a lot more comfortable for whoever is playing. Now, once you're able to do that, you're going to take it to concert tempo, which is 140, and you're going to play it at 140. You may feel a little bit uncomfortable, but that's always normal. The first time you play it at concert tempo is never going to be perfect, which is totally okay. Um, something that could be helpful is taking it a little bit faster than concert tempo. So let's say if concert tempo is 140, take it at like 150, 155. It makes it to where you're going a little bit faster so that when you slow it down, it feels more comfortable and easier to play.